Happy Cast Iron Wednesday. Hope everybody's doing great by the time you see this video. It's really early here in Texas, but I'm going to do a shorter video this week. It's going to be over breakfast, which is supposed to be the meal for this month. So I'm going to go ahead and knock that out. Um, I'm just going to make a basic breakfast. We're going to make some uh, stuff to, so my wife and my daughter can make some burritos later when they get up. So we'll get started. All right, guys, this is the star of the show today. It's an eerie second generation made in the late 1880s. Really nice pan. Uh, I've got this one in a nine. Might try to find some of the other sizes. I'm not sure. I really like these, and I like the uh, 1920, 1924 Wagners. I think mainly because they... They're really close on how they feel and how they cook, but they're both really, really good pans. All right, here we go. I've got the um, stove starting to heat up. You always want to preheat your pan, so I'll let this sit for a little bit and let it get up to temperature. All right, we've got the sausage in there. It's going to take it a little bit. We'll get it browned up real good and broke down in little bitty pieces. And then we will uh, put the eggs in there and get that mix good. If it was just for me, it wouldn't have as much sausage in it, of course. And I already have jalapenos going in with the sausage to add a little kick to it. But don't want to add that in case the girls, you know, don't feel like they want some hot stuff today. All right, sausage is looking good, so we will add some eggs to it. Sure did quiet it down pretty good. We'll let it sit here cook for a minute and then we'll start stirring it up. Well guys, that's pretty much it. She's all ready to go. I'm going to transfer this to a bowl so I can uh, have it ready for the girls. Put some cheese on top, let it melt down. Clean out the pan, which nothing stuck to this old Leary, so it's going to come right out. And uh, probably just have to wipe it out. That's what it looks like. It's not sticking at all. Um, did want to show one thing. A real good friend of mine that cooks in the uh, Dutch oven group that we started here. He's an excellent leather worker. And he made this for me. And man, I just, I mean, it just blows me away on how good it is. I went over to his house, went in his shop. It was some of the most beautiful leather stuff I've ever seen in my life amazing and uh, he's been making these just plain ones and then he does all kinds of different patterns i'm going to start taking them to flea markets and help him sell them out you know when i can but there's breakfast guys hope y'all have a great cast iron wednesday and like always we'll see you next wednesday